Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a premiere of Lauren Spear. Um, uh, this request actually came in from uh, one individual and um, I'm not sure if multiple people uh, wanted this request, but um, definitely um, somebody was uh, wanting this request. So um, I do have my notebook out and um, I'm gonna be writing everything down. Um, and I'll show you everything obviously at the end, but um, I was trying to get um, these requests done um, and available in a timely manner, okay? So uh, this is going to be on Lauren Beer. Um, this is going to be what happened to Lauren Spear. I believe that is how you pronounce her name. I hope everyone is doing well while I am shuffling. I will make my announcements. Um, thank you to everyone who has been liking, sharing, and subscribing. I greatly appreciate you. And also everyone who has been sending me emails and checking up on me and sending me positive feedback. I greatly, greatly appreciate you. Um, forgive me, my camera is bouncing up and down. My table is very sensitive. So um, we're going to get into this reading, okay? All right, here we go. This is going to be for Lauren Spear. Um, also, you know, I want to say this too as well. I really don't know anything about this case at all. I know it's public and all that, but however, um, the only thing I have is a picture of her. Um, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just say, you know, um, I'm just gonna say that. All right. So first thing I'm picking up is, um, she got into a lot of fights at school possibly like with specific people. I feel like um, maybe even specific people in general. Um, and I don't think they were like physical fights. I kind of feel like this was verbal confrontation. Um, because I feel like, um, I do feel like she was a very likable person, but I do feel like... Um, I'm just kind of seeing not a good um, atmosphere with either people at school or people that she was in somewhat association with. Um, because uh, what, what they're kind of saying here is, um, not a very good atmosphere or, um, not a good atmosphere. All right. Um, and I'm writing this stuff down, so I'll probably, um, I'll probably show you guys everything that I write down, but I really just writing down everything important. Okay. Um, but she had a lot of success in school. Like I see her very um, bright. I see her very uh, interactive at school. It's like, it's kind of like she was a very likable person, but I feel like as well, she did have her random confrontations with um, specific people or um, maybe even people that weren't entirely in her social group. Uh, 
Um, I also feel like she had a lot of plans to go to a specific college, okay? Um, she had, it was, it was almost like she had one particular college that she had in mind um, that she really, really, really wanted to go to. Um, One thing I'm kind of seeing with her too is she carried, I, I don't know, it's like she carried a lot of things. Like she, I don't know, maybe she carried, she had a lot of things that she was carrying on her shoulder. Um, I'm kind of seeing, what I'm kind of feeling here is she was carrying too much, carrying um, something on her back or um, I feel like maybe this has something to do with something in her backpack, possibly. Um, I kind of feel like um, maybe she, this is uh, something to do with her. Uh, this might be something to do with her disappearance, okay? Um, So she doesn't really strike me as she doesn't really strike me as the bullying type because I feel like I feel like a lot of people might have labeled her like that. Like they might have labeled her as somebody that would bully somebody else, but she doesn't strike me as that type of person. Um, wow. Okay, let me see. Um, the one thing that I'm, and they keep, they keep, uh, pointing this at me, um, carrying too much or like, um, it's almost like she was like walking somewhere and somebody saw that she was carrying too much on her shoulders or, um, it's almost like she had a lot of stuff that she was carrying. I see a lot of mothering energy around her, so I kind of feel like um, she was mostly close with her mom for the most part. Um, um, I kind of feel like her mother felt, um, they're also saying her mother felt it first. Um, mother felt it first. Um, or mother reported it first. Um, maybe even along the lines of, um, I feel like the mom has been receiving some type of intuitive messages or something like that. Um, uh, 
Um, maybe even along the lines of heavy dreaming, heavy sleeping. Um, other thing is, is I feel another gentleman here in the mix. Um, possibly somebody that she could have very well may have been romantically involved with. All right. Um, this gentleman is quite insecure. I will say this. Um, He is, I want to say, maybe a little bit older than her. Um, I, I will be surprised probably two, three years. Um, also feeling, feeling for him like, oh, feeling for him. Um, it's almost like he had, he had or has um, a nice vehicle or something like that. Because I'm kind of seeing like driving fast, going fast. Um, maybe even to the point where, um, maybe he was trying to rush her into some type of relationship. That's what I kind of feel like. Um, okay. So what else? This doesn't really feel mutual either. Um, it almost feels kind of one-sided, almost. Um, This almost feels one-sided. Yeah, that's what it's feeling like right now. Um, Yeah, this is this almost feels like stalkerish too. Um, yeah, this feels very stalkerish, very, very uh, stalkerish energy. Um, It's okay. All right. I hear you. Come on. Sorry. So every once in a while, my camera literally glitches out when I get into some of these readings. Like it's already happened to me a couple times. So. I had to pause the camera for a minute. Um, so what I was saying was this feels like stalker-ish energy right now. Um, it's it's almost to the point where it kind of feels like um, maybe even following somebody home, um, trying to find out um, where they live and stuff. Like this... Uh, that's what this kind of feels right now. And it's kind of also feeling like it's somebody that she either is acquainted with or knows of, um, or knows of this person. 
maybe not even so much acquainted with. It's kind of um, knows of. So hopefully my camera doesn't glitch out again. Um, it's been happening to me the more that I keep doing these. So <laughs> somebody's messing with my camera here, obviously messing with my equipment. Um, Yeah, this really is feeling one-sided. I, I don't feel like, it's almost like, um, it's almost like this person kind of wanted to get married or something like that. Like, I, I just kind of feel like this person is a little, um, cause that's what it's really feeling like. Um, So it's kind of like an obsessive energy too. Uh, obsessive or um, maybe not obsessive, possessive. Um... Yeah. Yeah. It's and it's kind of like too, you know, the other thing too is they saw her as some type of way to like make a lot of money or um it's I don't know, like th that's kind of what I'm the vibe that I'm feeling here. And it's kind of weird because it's like um It's kind of like um, this person saw saw some type of future or some type of like building something up or something like that or being rich or uh, something along those lines. Um, the other thing that I'm really feeling here is <sighs> cement. I don't know why cement is coming to my mind, but... Um, when I saw this card, that was one of the first thing that came to my mind. So it's like, um, one of the things that I feel here is, um, possibly cemented. Um, somebody cemented the evidence or possibly cemented her somewhere. Um, cause I see kind of like cinder blocks or, um, being cemented somewhere. Um, but I think I'm going to wrap it up there. Um, I hope this kind of helped somebody, um, possibly, um, this is kind of a weird one because I know my camera kind of messed up a little bit. But um, I will see you guys next time. Everyone take care. Um, keep liking, sharing, and subscribing. And also sending me missing persons requests because I'm going to still continue to do them. Um, but everyone stay safe out there. Everyone um, take care. Bye for now.